pandemic halted the traditional noon organ recitals on Temple Square, the first time in more than a century. But thanks to modern technology, the tradition will resume tomorrow. No live audience, but with a world watching online. Since March, there has been an eerie feeling inside the tabernacle. The organ sat quiet. The dominoes kept falling, then suddenly we were left in kind of this limbo with nothing to do. As the world shut down, so did the musical offerings on Temple Square. No choir, no organ recitals, just silence. We've been doing organ recitals here on an almost daily basis for over 100 years. And so as far as I'm aware, this is the first time that we've had to take a hiatus. But as restrictions begin to ease, an idea, let the organ play again. with a virtual audience. We thought that under these pandemic conditions, we organists were really the only members of the organization in a position to make some sort of musical offering. Now Andrew Unsworth and the rest of the organists on Temple Square will return to where they belong. I just worked from home or I'll go to my local LDS chapel to practice there. And uh, when things started to relax a little bit, I started coming back occasionally just to, on my own early morning or. Uh, when I knew no one else was going to be here to play the tabernacle organ. And like, oh man, <laughs> this is so nice. While the performances will be unlike any in the history of the organ recitals at Temple Square, they will be able to reach a bigger audience. But most of the people who come are tourists who may or may not know anything about music. So I'll be really curious to see what kind of audience we get. Soon anyone, anywhere, can virtually watch the talent playing inside the tabernacle at Temple Square. The virtual concerts will begin with a kickoff concert tomorrow at 7 p.m. Then the weekly concert series will begin streaming Monday at noon with virtual shows on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. You can find a link to watch it all online at abc4.com.